guys, what's good? As per requested, Jason is back with another physics lecture. Fair warning, he does use a lot of analogies, especially because he knows a lot about like court and law, so he tries to relate a lot of it to that. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoy this lecture, and without further ado, I'll let Jason take the stage. What's up, everybody? What's going on? It is XNLE, aka Convicted Felon, aka Jason, and I am here to give you guys another professor lecture about some physics shit. So today we're going to be talking about kinematics, kinematics, k-i-n-e-matics, you know, however the fuck you want to pronounce it, that's what we're talking about. So there's a, there's a few core topics that you guys need to know about kinematics, and the core concepts are displacement, velocity, acceleration, and time. You know, those are the big four when it comes to kinematics. Now, I'm going to go through and explain each one of those in a way for all of you fucking, you know, people to f understand, you know, because I'm good at what I do. You know, I get paid to do this shit. And, alright, just fucking listen, alright? I just got a Clash of Clans notification. Alright, just fucking listen, alright? So, first off, guys, we're going to be talking about displacement. Basically, it's like the change in position. So there's movement, like it's it's a change in position, you know. It has a direction. There's some formula, but you don't need fuck the formula. Um, if it, if the formula isn't how you cook crack, it really does not matter. So the displacement guy, hold on, give me a sec. Okay, 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 guys, so the displacement. You started the night off at your, your fucking plug's house, and, and in the middle, like, later in the fucking night, you ended up, like, butt-ass naked in a Waffle House, like, 12 miles, 12 miles away from his fucking house. That's displacement. That's my displacement. It doesn't fucking matter. Let's say you started the night at 9 p.m., and at 12 p.m., you're at the fucking Waffle House. 9 p.m., you started at your plug's house. 12 p.m., you're at the Waffle House. You don't know what the fuck happened between 9 and 12 p.m., but that doesn't fucking matter, because there was a movement before you were at your plug's house, and now you're at the Waffle House, butt-ass naked, eating some waffles, alright? So that's displacement. It doesn't matter what you've been doing for the 9pm to 12pm, it doesn't matter, 12am, I don't give a fuck, it does not matter. Displacement is you are here, and then you're somewhere else. That's displacement. Alright guys, the next thing we're going to talk about is the velocity. So, velocity is like, um, basically like how fast you were going and what direction, pretty much, you know. There's like an average velocity, you know, formula equation, but don't don't worry about that. It really is not that important. All right, the velocity is how fast you're going plus the direction, you know. And so if you don't understand what that means, basically, let's say I had um 10 grams. No, let's say I had 10 pounds, 10 kilos of in my bag. I'm just driving, I'm driving, and then the cops pull up behind me. So I start running from the fucking cops at a solid 10 meters per second, or 10 miles, 100 miles per hour a second. And, and you know, I zoom down the fucking highway. That's velocity, because I'm going 100 miles per hour away from the cops. It doesn't matter if it's away from the cops, you know, it could be away from anybody, it could be away from a crackhead, away from a hoe, uh, you know, it, do it doesn't matter. So it's how fast you are fucking going. Um, you know, let's say, like, another example is you just did one of those at the fucking uh, at a gas station, and you start tweaking and spinning around in circles right outside of a gas station. That's speed. You're spinning around really quick, but there's no direction. So that isn't velocity. Velocity is direction plus speed. Got it. Okay, 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 okay. But next, we're going to talk about the acceleration, pretty much. The acceleration is, um, you know, like the change in velocity over time. So how fast, like, let's say I was going, like, like in the previous example, I was going 100 miles per hour away from the cops. Well, now they got the helicopter on me. So now I'm going 200 miles per hour away from the cops. I accelerated 100 miles per hour to 200 miles per hour. So I accelerated a whole another 100 miles per hour just to get away from the motherfucking cops and move my move my 10 kilos, you know, I gotta fucking move that shit. So, all right, so acceleration. Let's say, you know, like, you know, you're, you're paranoid and shit and you gotta smash on the gas, you know, because like, you know, that's fucking acceleration, you know, it doesn't matter. If you if you don't know what acceleration is, you're a Next, the last thing that I was uh, talking about before was time, you know, pretty much how long something takes, you know, not a lot of people know what time is, T-I-M-E, 
not a lot of people know what that is you know luckily you have me to teach you exactly what this shit is so 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 pretty much like it's 4 a.m been up since wednesday you know i'm doing my it's on a timer i gotta know when i'm gonna cook i gotta know when i gotta get the re-up i gotta know when the cop shift change you know time matters you know what i mean let's go back to the previous example from when i was running from the cops in the time that it takes for me to get away from the cops I mean, I could do that personally in like a minute, like, you know, I got the high-speed Bible, you know, I'd be zooming, but the average person, the time it will take is around like 30 minutes, you know, it's gonna take you 30 minutes to run away from the cops, so that's the time, that's the time, that's the time. Now, now, if you really wanna go into like the, the smartness of this shit, you could like get the equations, I'm sure, I'm sure Gib is going to post, like put up the equations every time I fucking mention it. So, you know, you'll see them, but don't worry about them, just, just hold on. Okay, I think Jason is tired now, but thank you so much for that lecture. I hope you guys learned a lot about physics. I feel like I got a better insight in regards to kinematics. And I hope you guys also enjoyed this video and found it entertaining. But thanks for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.